Good day everyone, my name is Lingam, son of Ramasami. The topic of my presentation today will be the laser cleaning process for the removal of surface corrosions on standard steel access 304. Let me begin my presentation with a presentation's outline to give all of you an overview what are the topics that I'm going to present. So I will be begin my presentation with an introduction, moving to objective or the innovations impact and also next, the methodology, where in the methodology, I'll be explaining the laser mechanism that involved in the cleaning process. And also some of the video uh, where how the experiment has been conducted and moving forward to the results and also will be concluded my presentations. Laser cleaning as an idea technology that replaces conventional chemical technique for coating removal process. Has a cleaning process can be used in many industrial applications such as automotive industry, manufacturing industry, aerospace, ship maintenance, and electronic industry. Figure 1 show and real applications has been applied for an automotive parts and also the metal substrate with and comparisons of a cleaning surface using laser and also the corroded surface. Innovation impacts. So there's two innovation impact, which is first for the environment and the next for the social economy. Uh, as for the environment, laser is a safe and eco-friendly because we only need a light amplitude to uh, use in this technology. Next, uh, social economy. By increasing the implementations of laser technology and SME leading to an advanced technology. Due to the industrial revolutions 4.0, the laser technology has become one of an advanced technology for all the industry to be applied. So, uh, for the methodologies, uh, I, will be I will start uh, the explanations of the mechanism involved in the laser cleaning process. Uh, there's two mechanisms involved, which the first mechanism is a laser applications, and also the next one is a laser thermal decompositions. So let me begin the explanation with the illustrations, graphical illustration for the laser applications. First, uh, the laser beam will be transformed uh, the first micron of the coated layer into high compressed plasma. And then next, through the high compressive plasma, it will generate a shock wave on the metal substrate, which will eject the layers of the coating into a fine particle. And then next, uh, the coating or the corroded um, the oxide layer will be removed fully from the metal substrate. This is how an laser applications work. Uh, moving forward to the thermal decompositions, uh, as for the thermal decompositions, it's not uh, like a laser applications, where the graphic il graphical illustrations shows that for the thermal decompositions, we will be heating with the high intensity of laser energy towards the metal substrate surface in order the coating to be removed slowly through the high energy intensity. So for the lasering process, we have been used 30 watt uh, pulse with nanosecond fiber laser machines to conduct our experiments. In order to conduct the experiment, we need to be precisely adjust the parameter uh, such as laser power, scanning speed, focal distance, frequency, pulse width, and hatching distance in order for us to be conducted the experiment. However, some of these parameters will be fixed and some of, uh, through some adjustment of the parameter, the lasering process has been conducted. So uh, the video of how an experiment conducted will be shown. In the video, we will show uh, how the software works. So we use EasyCAD software uh, to adjust the parameter. As you all can see in the right-hand side, the adjustment parameter of the power, frequency, scanning speed, and pass width will be set in these machines. And also on the left-hand side, some of the sizing of the marking area and also the hatching distance will be 
set and also the defocusing distance can be adjusted in these machines. First, we will put the metal substrate below the laser head and also adjust the defocusing distance in order for us to start our lasering process. In the first lasering process, we will be uh, remove the depth of the corrigan surface before we start to smoothing our surface. In the second layer, we will smoothen the surface of the uh, metal substrate by adjusting some of the parameters. Uh, apart from uh, laser cleaning process, we also can remove the quarter surface. Uh, for example, as shown in here, we remove the paint surface on the metal substrate. So as for the result and conclusions, uh, we can conclude that uh, through the laser cleaning process, we can use uh, to remove the corrosions and also the paint removal from an optical microscope in figure seven for both corrosion removal and pen removal has been shown. So uh, the corroded on the metal substrate, we has been corroded the metal substrate for one year. And also uh, after that, we has been conducted an experiment on the removal, corrosion removal process. So it seems goes to the pen removal, we has been coated the metal substrate with a paint. And also we, uh, start to do a laser cleaning process by using the laser. So as you all can see from these two tables, the first table is showing the precise parameter that we set uh, to remove the corrosions. And also the next, uh, the second table show the pen removal process. So the marked area with the red color shows that the best parameter used in our laser machines uh, remove the corroded surface and also the painted or the coating layer on the metal substrates. So from these figures, uh, it can show that by adjusting some of the parameter and uh, we can remove the corroded surface slowly. So the past, the best parameter, which is for the corrosion removal will be 90% of power with 20% of frequency with two marking loop. So we can see that uh, through this process from an optical image, it shows that the surface of the corridor has started to remove. However, there's still a black strain uh, appeared on the surface. But by smoothing the surface, it shows that the corridor has been removed from the metal substrate. Moving forward, uh, as for the uh, coating removal or the paint removal, uh, we only adjust the power parameters on the laser machines uh, to see the effects of the high intensity energy towards our metal substrate. But we can see that by increasing the power, uh, the coating layer start to uh, remove from the metal substrate completely. The best parameter uh, for this uh, coating removal will be 70% of power with three marking loops. So as a conclusion of my presentation today, I would like to conclude with the laser cleaning process is a fast and time-saving technique it could be useful for many industrial uh, through the era of industrial revolution 4.0. And this technique is an environment friendly compared to a current conventional chemical technique. And so the surface of the metal subject will not longer damage by using uh, the new technology. So that's all for my presentations and some additional info that I would like to give is we has been uh, published uh, two papers on this topic. The first papers uh, and also the second paper is still under review for International Journal of Technology and Engineering Studies. Thank you very much.